then you will be poem english i no more ask you to be proud of yourself for i have seen enough kind hearted people turn into cruel monsters on account of their dogmas and xenophobias killing raping and harming those that do not carry the same pride in the same measure i merely ask you to not be ashamed of being yourself so long as you are not hurting others or yourself i do not care if you are a lefty or a fatty or a fairy or even merely hairy for these and many other attributes that pertain to you primarily you and only you are yours to live with and enjoy while you are at it these have little to do with those multitudes that suffer under the yoke of other shames or are shameless enough to not even be ashamed of killing raping and harming others these same multitudes that take pleasure in shaming you merely because you do not carry the same shame in the same measure shame has to do with them not you shame has to do with them not you so i merely ask you to not be ashamed of merely being you for short of not being there is no freedom from being you and short of being not conscious there is no freedom from knowing what you are even though that knowledge often takes its time coming and to many that knowledge never comes you are lucky that she has deigned to bestow upon you her radiant smile revel in the knowledge that for now this knowledge is yours to live with yours to love yours to worship shame is to believe that you would rather live with shame than under the benevolent gaze of saraswati our first mother shame is to believe that others can arrogate to themselves the right to shame you merely for being yourself shame is to believe that you should or even could be any but yourself shame is to believe that you can free yourself 
of your self for believe you me there is no place on this earth or elsewhere where you can find yourself comfortable without being yourself no matter where you will go no matter where you will go there you will be